Here we are up on top of Big Red. You see Wendy up the top there, Wendy! <laughs> so we dropped the tyre pressures down to 10 on the trailer, 15 on the rear and 12 on the front. Come up third gear, low range, no problems at all. Uh, it's a little bit dug up, a little bit of hopping, but just kept the momentum up and there's no hesitation, no uh, look of losing traction at all. So start off with plenty of flotation and thumbs up. Better just show you around. And it's a beautiful overcast cool day. I reckon it's probably only 18 degrees. We had a bit of rain last night, so we might find that the dunes are pretty firm. And um, big red behind us. Well, not yet. Still on top of it, got to go down. Uh, but what you can see here coming up is what Joel Fleming reckons is uh, that one there is the hardest dune in the Simpson. So anyway, here we are. We, we, we had lots of suggestions from um, from our ultimateers about which way we should go to get to Darwin. And we kind of decided we we're going to go on the QAA and then turn right and go up the Hay. So hopefully we'll be in Batten Hill in a few nights time and, uh, and still make it to the Darwin show. So here we are on the very highest bit of Big Red. Um, and uh, just drove up a piece of cake. My navigator found the spot, no problems. And uh, if we turn around a little bit here, see behind us, that's where we're headed. And of course that fantastic rig that's got us here so far and is going to get us up to Darwin. What do you reckon, sweetie? Yep, let's go. Okay, <laughs> let's rock and roll. Some of you might have noticed that there's two uh, bat bikes sitting on the roof just here. Uh, we didn't, we were a bit lazy, we didn't take them off tonight. Now that's 30 extra kilos of weight on top, so it's a bit of extra effort, bit of muscle required. To close it tomorrow, I'll probably have to have Wendy on the lifting pole as well. This is not something that I probably recommend going forward. However, with the automatic lifting system, I'm really keen to be able to try this and see how easy it is. I imagine it's, it's pretty easy. So um, we'll show you some more on that later. afternoon you might note that we've acquired some new headwear <laughs> what do you think well I gotta tell you if you were out here you would think it was pretty good because these flies are thick as I mean really what do you think of that and the sunset we're about to see and uh, but turn with me, this is where we do a pan win. Oh. Pan left, there you go. <laughs> so we'll show you just around here. We're on a swale between sand dunes on the QAA line uh, in the Simpson Desert. Now we've come inside, you'll notice we've changed our hats or got the fly veils off. So that's because inside an ultimate, you can cook dinner, you can drink, you can get away from those flies um, when you need to and when you're keen chuck on the fly net and go and party <laughs>
what day is it? When? The 15th of June. The 15th of June. Uh, uh, Friday, isn't it? Yes. Friday. Wow. Losing track of time. You might even notice I don't have my watch on too. So here's Wendy and I, and uh, we're at the uh, junction of the Madican line and Camp 16. Camp 16 on the Madigan line. I'm hopeless. And what's this track that we're on? <laughs> the Hay River track. The Hay River track. Goodness, maybe it's too more too early in the morning for me. But as you can see here, Wendy's just been signing the uh, the visitors book or the, the trip book, uh, which is in this weatherproof container. Uh, and we can see that there's obviously been quite a lot of people through before us. Not today. Today there's only been one crew. That was uh, Emily and Tim from Alice Springs in their Pajero. Oh, well, we met them yesterday be before the great, the big salt pan. Yep, yep. So just before the start to the Hay River. Hay River track. Thank goodness. I do the driving, Wendy does the navigating. Thank I'm... goodness for that or we'd be totally lost. Mind you, Wendy did, did some great dunes yesterday too. I did. I did. Yep. Good fun. Oh. Didn't get bogged at all. So we can hear another vehicle arriving, so we might sign off for now. <laughs> On the QAA line through the Simpson and we've come up the Hay River track. That's right, yep. yep. Lots and lots and lots of sand dunes. Yep. Lots of fun. Yeah, that was absolutely awesome. Uh, probably a little bit, I'm not sure if it's disappointed or pleased. We didn't get bogged once, didn't have any vehicle or, or camper trailer issues. Everything ran perfectly. Tire uh, pressures were perfect. We let our tires down and our camper tires and and that worked really well. Yep, yep. Uh, rear tyres on the Land Cruiser down to 15, front down to 10, and even the trailer down to 10 psi, and just traction and traction and more traction. And comfort inside as well. Mm. So, uh, so after coming up the Hay River track, we uh, come up to the Plenty Highway and turn left and uh, hit the Stewart Highway. Um, and we thought, well, why not go down to, um, to Alice, Alice Springs, Springs. Yeah, and have a boat peep. I've never been to Alice Springs. Hello, before. Alice Springs. <laughs> and uh, lovely town. We didn't do a lot there besides resupply and actually walk around the town itself. Um, but I tell you what, in the desert, we had two degrees uh, on a couple of nights. And when we got into Alice, what the temperature get down to? Oh, yesterday morning when we left, it was minus five degrees. Whoa, I think minus that, five. That's other than places like uh, up in the snowy mountains. I'd say that's about the coldest in the country. Certainly colder than we've experienced living on the coast, where we're a little bit pampered, I guess. But now we're 450 kilometres north of Alice, and it seems like a lot of the people travelling on the Sturt Highway towards Darwin. Uh, just pull over into gravel pits and the like and camp and there's we've seen lots and lots of road stops chock-a-block full of caravans and we really did not want to have that sort of stop so we saw a track down the side of the road we thought we'd take it and look where we are <laughs> Just finishing up at the Darwin show. We're all packed up. Thank you very much, Cameron and Vicky, and to Helen and Shane for helping us with their campers coming out of the bush hey, with them. Yay! 
Um, thank big, you. Big thank you to everyone that came and saw us at the Darwin show. Yep. Uh, and uh, we're heading off to deep into the Kimberleys. Heading west. Um, yep, that's west, isn't it? Is that where the sun is heading? So we're going to go that way. Yeah, we think. Yep, yep. Um, Dave, have a great time in Bali, mate. Thank you. Yep, Be we'll, safe. Yep. Always. Yep. And, uh, and thanks for doing the show with us, Dave. Pleasure. Yep. Yep. Good yep. fun. Good, yep. Very okay. good. Signing off from Darwin 4x4 show. Bye. From Michael, Wendy and David. Here's how good our rig looks. If you had forgotten. <laughs> How awesome is that?